Alright, so, hello everybody, um, and welcome back to an episode of Planet Zoo, um, and a brand new actual series. So, uh, Brixton Zoo is currently out of order at the moment, um, it's currently not working as it's supposed to, um, it's currently crashing, um, however that, it, I have been fiddling around with this new park, so I haven't actually tried it out in a couple weeks, so I think very soon I'll try it again. Hopefully, maybe it'll work after some time, um, but my god, we have a lot to talk about. Um, so we're going to start with the new series, obviously, that we're starting here. Um, so this is Oakwood Zoo. So this is supposed to be a little mini-series that we are doing a mini-park, like a community park, um, that has a bunch of random animals that aren't going to be so random anymore with the new DLC coming out, which we will get to. Um, we're starting off today with the Babarusa, which is an animal I don't really build for often. So I really wanted something as like an icebreaker kind of animal. Um, just something to like, I don't know, just like get the, get the guests into it. Um, the entrance I do not have a speed build for, I'm sorry about that. Um, it was something I just put together. Moving on to our next thing, which is the schedule. So, obviously my schedule is horrendous. The last Plan Zoo video we have was over like three weeks ago with the bat enclosure. We've only built for the pets and the raccoons. The other three, which are the wombats, the foxes, and the skunks, um, are yet to be seen. So if we, if I can get Brixton Zoo back, um, the skunks, the skunk video will be up next. And I'm hoping that's going to be out next week if Brixton Zoo works. I will probably put that on my Instagram um, saying if it works or not, because then if it does work, we'll have a new episode of Brixton Zoo and hopefully many more to come. If it doesn't work, I guess we'll just wait, and hopefully maybe the new update in DLC will help me out there. Um, I don't know what's going on with it. It worked a bit, then it's not working, then it's working again. I don't know. Um, that's why I started this new part to get a fresh start. And already, it's lagging like crazy, because I used way too many pieces. Um, but yeah, I really like this um, park. I don't think we're going to do as many tours, like real-time tours in this. I think I'll have some nice cinematic shots. Um, and stuff. So this is like our starting point. The next habitat we are going to do um, is going beside the Babarusa enclosure and that next part um, right beside it. It's going to connect to the shelter. I don't think it's going to go in the shelter. We're going to have a extension onto that building, um, which I don't know exactly what that's going to be. Maybe like the wombat or something. I'm really trying to fit in all these twilight pack animals before the new pack comes, which is the grasslands animal pack. And oh my god, this is, not even joking, my favorite pack already. This is, it, it looks amazing. Like, every every animal of the pack, aside from like one or two, mostly one, like honestly one, is my favorite and I love it. I love everything about this. The only animal that I don't, I'm not really thrilled about, but I'm still like, I, I still like that they're there, um, is the blue wildebeest. The blue wildebeest is very similar to the current wildebeest we have in the game, but it is still still a very good choice um but yeah everything else we saw in the pack we get eight new animals we get the caracal the main wolf the nine man armadillo the striped hyena the red necked wallaby uh what am i missing here that's five the emu the blue wildebeest and five different species of butterflies and i can't remember them all on the top of my head all i can remember is like um, there's a monarch there's a European peacock or peafowl. Um, I think it's peacock. Um, and three other ones. So yeah, we have basically 12 species if you count all the butterflies, um, different types of butterflies. This is easily probably definitely my favorite animal pack and might be my favorite pack of all because I love striped hyenas. I love caracals. Those are two of my favorite animals in the actual world. The only animals I'm missing from the game now that I really want to see is probably tree kangaroos. Tasmanian Devils, Porcupines, definitely like African Crested Porcupines, um, those are my top three, honestly, and a few others, like side ones, but all I want is a Porcupine, honestly, and of course, birds, a lot of people are respecting birds in this, um, December update, weird thing, or December DLC, weird thing is, is that the subject has, or the DLC has nothing to do with winter or Christmas, I would have thought that we would have had, like, a Tundra animal pack if it was gonna be, like, a biome pack. I guess not, um, which I'm perfectly fine with because I don't, I'm not complaining at all. I love all the animals in this pack, love the pack as a whole. Um, if it was Tundra, when I, hope, I, th I hope we are still getting a Tundra pack for like next year or something, so we can get muskox and 
another species of penguin and wolverine and all that good stuff. Uh, yeah. Um, so that, we've, we've covered the new, new, um, new series schedule, so I'll, I'll try to get the schedule as best as I can. The Brixton Zoo, um, Skunk Habitat, Outdoor Habitat is already done. Um, if I can get it to work, then I will finish the indoor area. And that, it shouldn't take me very long. I'm really trying to get back together with the schedule. I did upload a Fall Guys video last week. I just thought it might be a good, nice change. Um, I know people might not like it, but it, it's just something... Um, that I want to change it up. I want to expand the games we play on the channel. And I think that is going to be our stopping point for a bit. We have Planet Zoo. We have Planet Zoo. We have the Planet Coaster. Or sorry, not Planet Coaster. Planet Zoo. We have Fall Guys now. We have Prehistoric Kingdom, which is getting its new desert update soon. Very, very nice. Uh, and Jurassic World Evolution 2, which is also getting a new DLC. Um, in, I think it's December 8th. Um, which we're getting the rest of the Dominion species, which looks... Very, very promising. Another DLC that's probably one of my favorites of the actual game. Because the Atrociraptors, then we get the Allosaurus Battle of Big Rock skin. All the missing skins from the pack, we get all the new variants and stuff. Finally having different patterns and colors. Um, get like the Moros, the Lystrosaurus. All the missing species that we didn't get from the original Dominion pack. The Dominion pack. So, so exciting. We have so much coming in this next month. And I am ready. So, about this new pack... I am sorry for the Twilight Pack. Um, I am not able to um, make all the species um, videos about that stuff. We only got through two of them. I am very proud of those two habitats, though. I really like those. Hopefully, we can get the Skunk one up. I'm a su I I'm planning on getting the Skunk one up next week. Um, and then I think I might be able to add the Wombat to this park. And then maybe, or the Red Fox. So, the Red Fox and the Wombat will probably go in this park. So yeah, um, regarding other parks we have, like Yellowstone, I have no idea. Yellowstone is more of a simpler park, I don't think I'm going to get rid of it. I just don't know where to go from where we are at that point. Um, Phoenix Park is obviously kind of busted. Um, so yeah, but this new pack, the Grassland Animal Pack, you can expect I am going to try my hardest. Plus, I have the Christmas break coming up, and, like, after Christmas, I have, like, ten days off um, off of school. So, that is loads of time for me to build. I love everything about this month. We have new Planet Zoo pack coming out. We have the new Jurassic World Evolution 2 pack coming out. I'm going to try and make content for both of them. I'll do my best. Please hold with me. Um, I am sorry about the lack of videos in the past three weeks trying to get everything maintained and everything um so yeah I, I am very sorry about everything going on i hope you all enjoy this video um but yeah the grassland animal pack you can expect a lot of videos for that of me building am uh, habitats for those because i love all the animals in that pack and i am so excited to build for them um so yeah hope you all enjoy um i will see you all at the end for the cinematic shots and I hope you all are ready for the Grasslands Animal Pack coming December 13th. Mark your calendars, because that's going to be an exciting day for all of us Planet Zoo fans. And if you want Jurassic Evolution 2 content, hopefully I can start our new series that I was blabbing about about three months ago. <laughs> um, and I also do have a mini project coming up for Jurassic Evolution 2. I don't know if I can keep interest in it for much longer. I'll keep you guys posted on that. I was hoping on doing some sort of documentary series, kind of, in Jurassic World Evolution 2. Um, don't know if it's going to work out. Don't know if I'm going to get really that far into it, but I'm going to hope I'm going to try. Hope you all enjoy, guys, and I'll see you all hopefully on next Friday for um, a new Brixton Zoo video. If it's not, if it's not Brixton Zoo, Hopefully, it will be another episode of this park, adding the wombat to it. So, we'll definitely get one of the new Twilight Animals back. Really hoping. Hope you guys all enjoy. See you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.